Hello everyone, it's Benny, and welcome to an update. Now, since this is an update, I don't have too much to show you, so here's your obligatory rotating cubes, just to give you something to watch while I, well, I talk about this predicament. As you may have noticed, I didn't upload a video today, even though I have that scheduled. And you might be wondering, what's up with that, Benny? Have you cancelled the 3D Game Engine series or something? And now, don't worry, it's nothing that extreme. Unfortunately, I've had a minor scheduling issue. I, I counted on some a tiny time slot to record some of the 3D Game Engine videos, and unfortunately, stuff came up. So, that didn't happen. And that's why I'm making this video. Here's, here's the long and the short of it. All the videos for this week are going to be pushed back by one day. So the video that would usually come out today is going to come out tomorrow. The video that was going to come out Tuesday is going to come out on Wednesday. The video that was going to come out on Wednesday is going to come out on Thursday. And so forth and so on. And next week, we should be back on schedule. And I'm, I'm sorry for this. This is entirely my fault. It was poor planning on my fault, or my part. So, yeah. The good news is... I am going to be uploading five videos this week, six if you include this video. So even if things are going to be a bit displaced, at least you're going to get a lot of content. So there's that. And also that, yeah, that is kind of part of why I didn't have quite as much time as I hoped, but oh well. And just to be clear, even though it's only been two minutes, but just to be clear, all the videos for this week are still going to happen. They'll just be pushed back one day, and possibly rearranged a little bit, depending on how I have to record them. Again, I'm really sorry about all this. This shouldn't have happened. This was just downright poor planning on my part, and I'm going to take measures to make sure this doesn't happen again. So, yeah. And that's... and next week, we'll be back on schedule. Everything will be back to normal. And there. And that's the update. You can go ahead and close the video now if that's all you care about. But there's one more thing that I'm going to address while I'm here. A couple of people have asked me about doing 3D rendering without any external libraries. So no OpenGL, no DirectX, no Flyway Java Game Library, no, no anything. Just the basic Java standard library. So... I put together a little example project to see how that would work out, and this is the result. Here's some 3D rotating lit and textured cubes constructed entirely from just a draw pixel method. And here's what I found. It's interesting in its own right, but if I do a series, then one, it's going to be pretty big, so it's not going to be part of the side series, and I'm not going to be doing this in a main series for any time, anytime soon. But more importantly, I don't see the point of it. If you're going to do 3D rendering, then you're going to want to use a graphics card. If you're going to use a graphics card, you need to use some 3D API that allows you to use a graphics card. There's really no significant advantage, as far as I can tell, of doing 3D rendering without one. I think it's interesting in its own right, just to see how things are done, but I... I don't know about doing a series on it. If you people are really that interested in it, and you can think of a good reason why you would do 3D rendering without a 3D API, let me know, and maybe I'll reconsider. But at least for now, I don't want to do a series on it. That being said, though, I do, like I said, I do think it's interesting in its own right. So, I'm going to post my little example on GitHub. It's, <laughs> I'll be the first to admit, it's very patchworky. It's not... I, most of this is, has just been my experimentation. There's a few things that aren't used, and there's a few things that are not well organized. I'll definitely be the first to admit all that. But I still think it's interesting in its own right, and it might be useful to people if you really do need software rendering for some unknown reason. So yeah, and that's all the updates, so thank you. Hope you enjoyed, and see you tomorrow.